Today, we're going to look at graphic scores. A graphic score is a simpler way of showing how you want your music to be played. You do this by drawing the sounds. Here, I have drawn four simple sounds for you. See if you can match the drawing to the sound that you hear. Here's the first sound. Which shape, which drawing do you think this sound goes with? And here's sound number two. And how about sound number three? Which of the shapes is this one? And finally, sound number four. So here are the answers. Sound one was the guiro. And I show this with the zigzag pattern that it plays. Sound two was the shaking of the maracas. And this is the dotted drawing, the drawing of the dots. Sound three was the triangle. And notice how the sound starts loud and then gets quieter. And the shape I've drawn gradually goes down and down and down to a point to show this as the sound is getting quieter. And the final drawing is a large X to show the sound of a drum being hit. And that drum is only hit the once. So it's only one sound. OK, so it's your go. Why not try and draw the shapes of the following sounds? Now, remember, keep it simple. You're not drawing the instrument you're hearing, but you're drawing the sound that it makes. So it's a nice, simple shape, a simple graphic drawing you're doing. So try drawing the sounds of these instruments. First of all, the kabasa. And then the rain stick. How do you think the sound of the tambourine can be drawn? And what about the agogo? Let's draw the sleigh bells next. And finally, the wood block. So with all of those different instruments, see if you can draw simple shapes to show the sounds that are being made. Finally, what we can do, we can put all of these sounds together onto a graphic score page. So we can actually compose a piece of music and we can get people to play the piece of music that we've composed. Here's a simple way of drawing a graphic score. So I'm using the four instruments you heard at the very start. And each instrument has its own line. And what we do, just like reading a book, we read it from left to right. 
So as we go across the page, we can see which instrument is being played. Now this is important in music, not every instrument plays for the whole piece. So there'll be gaps where the instrument isn't playing. And then if you look here, you can see the arrows at the top and the bottom going gradually along the page to show where we are in the piece of music. So if I was playing the maracas, for example, I would only play when I saw the dots being shown. So now it's your turn. Why don't you create your own graphic score? And you can use your own four instruments. You don't have to use the ones that are here. You can choose any musical instrument you think you'd like to play. Make sure they're percussion instruments for now. See you next time.